Well, there's a park in Boulder County making a comeback. Pella Crossing had to be rebuilt after all that flooding back in 2013. And Denver 7's Connor Wiss gives us a tour of the finishing touches before the gates open to the public next week. If you came here to Pella Crossing back in 2013, it probably looked something like this. You had the bathroom completely on its side, as well as the sign, too. But fast forward three and a half years later, there's been a lot of construction done, and they're just getting ready to open in a little more than a week. The gates are reopening. But a few years ago, the floodgates opened a little too wide here at Pella Crossing, leaving 80,000 yearly visitors with a closed gate and no access to this recreation area. Work began this past September. Crews built breaches between ponds, rebuilt trails, and restored the trailhead. In this picture, what used to be an opening has now been filled and will be used as a path and an emergency spillway. It's a project that took years to approve, plan out, and now 3.5 five million dollars later is complete. We kind of had to assess all the damage and then we also had to go through a process of engineering, um, engineering design, uh, permitting with various federal agencies. We wanted to make sure we did a good job out here because it is such a popular place. With all the rebuilding came some additions. There will be equestrian parking next to the parking lot, and one of the ponds will be used as a nursery for native fish species. If you're already itching to get back to this park, there is going to be a ribbon cutting ceremony that is next Wednesday, April 26th at 4.30 p.m. In Boulder County, near Longmont, Connor West, Denver 7. Now, Boulder County is still working to open up the last park closed by all that flooding. That would be the Anuwai Trail in the northwest area of Boulder.